Yes, sir. What up, crypto world? It's your boy, Chris Garcia, a.k.a. Crypto Godson. Today, I'm going to be talking about how I am able to mine RSR on my MacBook. I recently tweeted this. This was actually yesterday. I set up unminable. I set up an unminable situation, I guess. I don't even know what to call it, honestly, but I set up a, you know, I set up a way to mine RSR on my MacBook. Um, some of you may be weary of this because if you're into computers, you know this can compromise your system. You know, obviously, if you um, heighten the workload over a long period of time and, you know, it could possibly overheat. So now I'm doing it only on my Dell, which is my secondary laptop, basically the laptop that got me through college. It's a, you know, pretty old laptop. It's not my MacBook, which is my, you know, a necessity for me on a daily basis with respect to crypto and just in general. So I would highly advise if you guys have a primary gaming laptop, gaming setup, gaming desktop, use something that is robust. Um, don't use your primary laptop. If you do have a secondary laptop, use that. If you don't, I think there's pretty, you know, plenty of uh, low cost laptops you can buy on uh, Amazon for like, you know, 100, 200, 300 dollars, pretty cheap. I would go that route. And um, this is very new. So there are plenty of unknowns. I, you know, just set this up yesterday. I'm going to give credit where credit's due. Roger Tarabi, I definitely recommend you guys follow him. He's a lot more knowledgeable on the technical, you know, the computer side of it. So just so you guys know, just a little bit more insight. So, all right. So basically, from my understanding, this means mega hashes per second because that's his hash rate. So he's able to get 30 to 40 mega hashes per second off a single 2070 RTX GPU. So he's GPU mining, which is obviously more powerful than a CPU mining situation, which I'm doing on my, my laptop, on my Dell laptop. I'm not doing it on my, my MacBook, just like I described, because that's my primary laptop. I don't want to um, compromise any hardware on my main laptop, which is logical, right? So I don't recommend this for any of you guys that are trying to do this on your primary you know, laptop whatever it may be. If you do have a more powerful gaming laptop or, you know, a gaming desktop situation, I highly advise you to use that. And um, obviously it can be a bit more safe if the, if the system is set up to, you know, withstand high workload. So I want to make sure that's, you know, explained very straightforward. And I want to make sure that I don't, you know, um, point you guys in the wrong direction so that you compromise your laptop and or desktop situation. I'm going to, pull some power too. So there's unknowns there. So, I mean, in a nutshell, I'm going to try it. I'm going to keep my laptop, my Dell laptop plugged up and then, you know, just see how you see how much my bill goes up. But honestly, when I'm mining RSR, I don't have a profit, you know, motive in mind because I'm not mining with the current RSR price in mind. I think the RSR price will obviously go up and that's what I think will pay off you know, 10 times over, 100 times over based on, you know, what, what the RSR price is now, but where RSR price can go later because I'm, I'm going to hodl. But here's the unminable Twitter so that you guys can, you know, know this is legit. I didn't post a link just to post a link, you know, so I want to make sure you guys know that I'm not here to scam you guys. This is my referral link. So you guys can plug in this referral link at the end right here, and that'll give you a lower fee percentage because whenever you claim rewards whenever you put your auto auto claim rewards on it's gonna you know unminable is gonna take a percentage of that and if you put this referral code in there it's gonna give you a, a smaller percentage fee that you know unminable takes so that's you know obviously preferable if you want to you know reap your rewards in the best way possible here if you go to the unminable website there are plenty of other coins obviously that you can uh, mine but i and my rsr ranger so i'm gonna of course go to reserve rights and click that and then here you see they have graphics card options gpu basically right and then you got cpu cpu is what you want to use if you're just doing on your laptop if you're a regular person like me if you're you know a gaming person or if you're just a computer whiz and you have a powerful laptop obviously you can explore some of these options but i will go here and first thing you're going to do is click this right here get started with xmr rig and that's gonna prompt a download and then here i'll show you guys so uh downloads so it's gonna make you download a folder and then once that folder downloads open it up you're gonna go to the json file the dot json file you're gonna right click and you open with go to text edit 
and you're going to simply make some edits in here. So these are very important. So you're going to scroll down and then you keep, you're going to modify this right here. Previously, before you edit, it's just going to say no, like this right here. You're going to put some quotation marks and put RX slash zero. And then for the URL one, you're going to replace this website. So this website was not this website before. So you're going to make sure you switch that to RX dot unminable. It's, like this, it's already going to have a dot com and the um, colon and 3333. Leave that how it is, but make sure you change the beginning to RX dot unminable dot com. And then here under the user, you're going to put the coin. So in my case, it's RXR. And you're going to put the colon. And then right here, you're going to put your address where you want the RSR to be deposited, your ERC20 address. And then you're going to put a period. And then at the end, you're simply going to name your quote unquote worker, which is the device, the hardware, whatever it is. I just named my MacBook 2020 Mac GDSN, you know, short for Godson. And then if you have a referral code, you're going to put you know, the, the number sign, the hashtag sign, whatever you want to call it. And then you're going to put, you're going to paste the referral code there. So I'm not technically using this MacBook anywhere. I put the um, Rogers referral code on my Dell so that that way I can get a lower fee when I, you know, withdraw my RSR, but also he's going to be able to get a piece of my rewards, you know, just simple rewards mechanisms like most other rewards programs work. And then from there, you're going to make sure you go file, save, then once you save, close that out, and then all you do is open this up right here, XMR IG, and you're gonna open that up, and then from there, it's gonna open up. And then once you did that and saved it, you're pretty much set. All you gotta do is open this, and you're gonna wait about, it's gonna take about 15 minutes to get totally set up. So I'm not gonna obviously sit here for 15 minutes, but once you open that, you should be good to go. You just gotta let this, you know, let the system do what it does, and then, what you're going to be looking for is see these green words. At some point, it's going to say accepted. For me, it took about 15 minutes. So just be patient. And, you know, it's actually running now. And the way you can check to see if it's working. And then if you see right here, it says enter your address to check your stats. So for me, I'm going to paste my address right there and go search. So I already pulled it up over here. And you can check the current status. It's going to, you know, there's going to be some lag. So once it says accepted, you're not going to see instant results right here. There will be some lag. And um, so basically, you know, you can see your, your status. So there is my worker. Like right now, my Dell laptop is currently working up. I named it Dell 2018 GDSN. This is the referral code from Roger because I put it in on that JSON file. This is my current hash rate per second, which is 379, which is pretty slow. I mean, it's just a regular laptop. It's not you know, any gaming laptop or anything. It's a regular old Dell laptop. And um, so here I have my referral code that I can share with you guys if you want to benefit from this as well. This link will be below, of course. And then I put this on to auto pay the address I provided every four hours whenever the balance is over 1,338 RSR. So I'm only at one. Um, I think this is, so this is, this 1.44 was accumulated basically when I went to the movies with my wife yesterday. For So it, it took about, I think it, it was mining for about four hours, four or five hours maybe. And I was able to get 1.44. So if you scale that, you know, times six or whatever, times five or whatever, basically you're going to get about five RSR a day. You know, obviously at current RSR prices, that's under a dollar, right? But just think about when RSR gets to a dollar, two dollars, in my opinion, I think it will. Um, no, this is not financial advice. I'm just sharing what I know, sharing my personal opinion. And I think it will pay for itself over time. Um, like I said, this is brand new. I have not calculated the electricity costs. So if you do have a solar setup at your house, that is preferable, obviously, so that you're not, you know, paying directly to the electricity companies. You're able to sustainably mine, you know, just straight from the sun. So that's ideally what I want to get to. I'm in an apartment right now, so that's really not feasible. If I had a house, I'll do it in my backyard. Honestly, set up a little mining situation, plug my laptop up directly. And, you know, you're just getting RSR from the sun. From, and, you know, so I would definitely recommend that route. Um, from my, In my case, I'm just it's just testing. I mean, honestly, I'm more curious than anything. I'm not too worried about, you know, be, it, it being a net loss in the short term. Because, like I said before, I'm, you know, going to be holding RSR for the long term. 
I'm pretty sure there are plenty of questions that have not been answered on this video. I expect that. I still don't have a lot of these questions answered myself. So please comment your specific questions below. But I want to make sure I share this opportunity with you guys. It's exciting regardless, you know, if it's profitable or not. I think, you know, some of you guys that follow me are just like me. You're just curious. You're interested in the tech side of it. You're interested in just diving in, right? So just um, learning more. And that's what I'm doing through this. I want to learn more. I've, I've never really dove into the mining side of crypto. So that's why this is very interesting to me. Basically, I stopped mining on my MacBook yesterday because it was hot to touch. And I had good ventilation. It was hot to touch. Like, it was really hot. My uh, charger was hot. My uh, MacBook was hot. But when I do my Dell, like right now, it's been mining for about an hour now. It's not hot at all. So it makes me, it calms my, you know, emotions. But I want to make sure I share that information so that you can make your own decision. Um, if you like this info, please like, subscribe, comment down below any specific questions. If you're a, um, if you're a little bit more advanced than me, please share some insight below so we can help each other. Let's stay healthy and get wealthy.